morning and welcome everyone. I'm Mary Pat Higgins. I'm the President and CEO of the Dallas Holocaust and Human Rights Museum. And it's wonderful to see so many good friends here. Um, I am have really, really loved our partnerships um, with the local Dallas LGBTQ community and am really, really thankful for the work of Lambda Legal. Um, goodness knows the fight is not over um, and it's a, it's a very important time. So I'm excited to sit in on some of these sessions today and thankful for the work that Lambda Legal's doing. Just wanted to give you, I think most of you know about the museum, so I won't talk long, but for those who don't, we were formed in 1984 by a group of a small group of local Dallas Holocaust survivors. And uh, we were in the basement of the Jewish Community Center for 21 years. Then we moved downtown um, and were in a small rented space from 2005 till 2019 when we opened this building. And we are just celebrating five years of, of being in the Dallas Holocaust and Human Rights Museum. And I think that our museum is really unique and special because our survivors wanted to share the history of what happened to them and honor their loved ones who were murdered in the Holocaust. But they wanted to do that to impact Dallas, Texas, and to try to eliminate prejudice and hatred towards all groups. And we're very, very open and enthusiastic about us expanding the mission to cover other human rights issues. So I'm hoping you'll have some time at the end of the day and uh, tour as part of this experience. So if you haven't been through the permanent exhibition, I'm hoping that you'll go through. We have a little card for you that hits the highlights of must-see things um, related to LGBTQ history. Um, you'll see some in the Holocaust wing, and um, you'll see a lot of it in the final wing, Pivot to America. So please, you know, take a minute to go, or take many minutes to go through um, the permanent exhibition if you haven't gone through it yet and help spread the word that we are truly a Holocaust and Human Rights Museum. And our goal is to combat prejudice and hatred um, and indifference and to build a community of upstanders um, throughout North Texas and beyond. So I just wanted to say again, I really appreciate you being here. I love our partnership and I look forward to learning along with you this morning. Thanks. Hi. Um, good morning, everyone. My name is Seth Rosen. I'm the Chief Development Officer of the American LGBTQ Plus Museum. And we're really thrilled uh, on, to um, myself and the board and staff of the museum to welcome you to this incredible opening weekend in Dallas of Queer Justice, our first traveling exhibit celebrating 50 years of Lambda Legal's triumphs and advocacy. Um, uh, this is our first traveling exhibit, and when I saw it uh, in New York City, I was really brought to tears because it is not only American history, it's queer history, and it is our future because the attorneys and uh, advocates at Lambda Legal are what will bring us into the future and, and secure our families and our individual rights. So I really welcome you to come see it at Resource Center. We'll be there with the exhibit until the beginning of October, and we're just incredibly grateful. Uh, the American American LGBTQ plus museum uh, works to preserve and uplift queer history and culture. We do traveling exhibits around the country and I'm thrilled to say we are in construction with our first permanent home at the New York Historical Society uh, in New York City on the Upper West Side. And we welcome you uh, to come visit us there. We'll be open in 2027. And in the meantime, we'll be traveling around the country doing our public programming. I'm incredibly grateful for our partnership with Lambda Legal, uh, with, to, with the museum, and also um, with the Resource Center. And I really wanna thank the Zagar Family Foundation, the Embry Family Foundation, and Bloomberg Philanthropies for their incredible support. So welcome, today will be wonderful. And if you have any questions, please find me. Thank you.
So good morning, everybody. My name is Shelly Skeen. I'm the regional director for Lambda Legal. I use she, her pronouns, and I can't say enough about what I think we've just heard. We've heard about partnerships. We've heard about community. And so we are grateful to be here today celebrating the beginning of our Queer Justice Exhibit, which will be at the Resource Center in Dallas through October the 7th, and then also doing this in conjunction with the American LGBTQ Museum and also the Holocaust and Human Rights Museum, and that is what this is. This is a human rights museum. So we are so grateful to have you all here today. Um, just a few housekeeping things. We're gonna have MCLE credit for lawyers who are licensed in the state of Texas. There will be a code um, on our screen that you'll be able to go and claim that credit online. And if you have any questions, need any help with that, please don't hesitate to reach out to me. And we are again grateful to have you here. Lambda is in its 51st year. We are working towards an unstoppable future for LGBTQ plus civil rights and also for the civil rights of people who are living with HIV everywhere. And you're gonna hear more about the story of Lambda Legal today. You will see it at the exhibit at the Resource Center. So please do go and take the time to look at the exhibit or reach out to us. And we're more than happy to take a group of you through the exhibit. Thank you, Shelley. Thanks, everybody. As Shelley said, I'm Lauren Muti. I am and the immediate past chair of the board of directors of Lambda Legal. And um, just briefly, you know, I've been involved in Lambda for many, many years, uh, long before I was on the board. Uh, and the reason that I got involved with Lambda is because I felt like looking over the history of the victories that had been achieved, um, Lambda was really the brain trust of the queer movement. And if it hadn't been for the work of Lambda, you know, I, I mean, I'm a queer white woman with three black children living in the suburbs of Dallas, Texas. And um, thanks to the work of the gentleman here uh, and the great work of Lambda Legal, that, you know, that was inconceivable um, in the 70s and 80s. And because of that work, you know, my family gets to be. And I, as a board member of Lambda, am particularly grateful to the Resource Center and to the Dallas Holocaust Museum and the great partnerships that Lambda and many of our other um, brother and sister organizations uh, have, we've really come together as a movement. And I'm very, very grateful to be part of that movement and very, very grateful to have all of you here. And so with that, I'll turn it back over to the people you're really here to see. So thank you everybody. Thank you. 